I first realised when things started happening, there were a lot of arguments. Um, I was quite bad on drink and drugs. And it was just a lethal combination once that got out of you and you just start with your mouth. I mean, there's all aspects of abuse these days. And I started off with verbal abuse, using my mouth to try and beat my partner down. And then it just escalated. It goes from one to other. And it's so quick how it, how it all changes. So it started off with verbal abuse, to be fair. Basically, when I got, got locked up, I had to go to court. That were probably one of the scariest sounds of the doors shutting a car that I've ever heard in my life. And I know then something went wrong and something needed to change because I don't want to hear that again. Not a chance. I went to probation um, and I sat and spoke to my probation worker, which she, she was a lovely woman. Um, and sometimes she saw that I'd gone in and I. I'd bumped into someone in, in Wakefield that probably might not have known them. They just looked at me wrong and I'd gone in. And she could tell that I was a bit worked up and she'd ask me what. And I was like, oh, some silly get outside. She's been staring at me for summer and I don't know what it is. And it's, it's, it's really getting to me. And I felt like I was running out and smashing the red in. And she says, well, don't you think you could do with trying to sort that temper out? Um, so I was like, at first I was a bit like, well, no, it's not done me wrong so far. But then when I thought about it to myself when I was at home, it was actually, yeah. I mean, I'm, I'm only young. I've got a long way to go yet. And if I've already done what I've done so far, it's just going to get worse. So it was like a big, big, someone just opening their mouth and saying it was like, right, yeah. We'll try this. I mean, I, w I went, I tried on a probation, which some work, some don't work. That one wasn't for me. Um, I, st I've, I started this one, and it covers all different aspects of things. And I even started going to the gym, so if I felt a bit worked up, it's good to just get in a boxing, boxing bag and just smack in a boxing bag instead of smacking somebody. At least you're not getting into trouble for it. Not worry about it. Talk. Fine. Just just reach out. Talk. It don't make you don't make you no less of a man. To be honest with you, I feel more of a man being able to open up and just say to people, when they're like, "Look, I've done I've done this. I've all my hands up. I needed help, and now I've I've done all this. I've got." My family that I wanted. I've got a job that's good. I don't don't have to worry about things. And life is a lot better. Instead of worrying, I've just done this. Is someone going to come and lock me up? Is it going to happen again? I just it's just like a million times better. And there's no no better than coming somewhere like I've come here and been so open and understanding. They just make you feel, make you feel at home. They're not, they're not here to judge you. They're just, they're just there to listen to what you've got to say. Give you a few pointers. It's down to you if you want to use what they say. But they do, they do make a lot of sense and some people struggle to find, to realise it. But it is right what they're saying. So, yeah, just be a man. Talk. So no, one want, no one wants to go to jail. So I'll just talk. That's a million times better. I can have a laugh with a girlfriend. She's not worried that I'm going to be going off my head and doing something towards her. She can sit there, watch a film with us, and she don't, she don't need, feel the need to like flinch if I move to get a drink. She don't need to feel anything. She knows I'm there. And I'm there for her, and we're all good. Uh, yeah, a, a hell of a lot. Well, life in general is a million times better. No, 
Obviously, I do. I drink a stone, but it's in moderation. I know. I know now. Not to get to the point of no return. You get to a certain point, you start feeling it. That's been for night. I've got me. I've got my family. I can do stuff with my girlfriend. Me and my girlfriend can go out with his kid. We can do what we want, and we're we're a hundred times better. If I didn't do any of this, I wouldn't. I, I wouldn't have had that. It'd have been totally different. So now, I feel like I've won lottery. It's amazing.